Hey Android fans, this is Eric from HollywoodFrodo.com with another Android app review. Today I'm going to be talking to you about the app Commander. Right before I get to that, just want to remind you this review is sponsored in part by AndyTags.com, which is a great website to find out all about NFC on your phone and what it can do, and pick up some NFC tags and keychains as well. So head over to AndyTags.com after the review and check those out. So Commander is a really cool app. Basically what it does is it expands the capability of Google Now uh, voice commands. Um, Google Now has a lot of built-in voice commands, uh, which is really cool. It can do a lot of things, but there are still a lot of things it can't do. With Commander, uh, you can expand what it can do. Um, it intercepts commands you give to Google Now and executes them. And it also integrates with Tasker, which means there's an unlimited number of commands you can give and uh, things you can have happen on your phone based on those commands. So uh, let's hop on my phone. I'm gonna show you uh, how it works, uh, what you need to do to set it up, and then show you just a few examples of some of the commands that I've created using Tasker with Commander so that now from anywhere on my phone with a quick command, I can have something happen. Okay, so here we are on my phone, and here is the app Commander. So let's tap that and open it up. And uh, first you enable interception by clicking the check button. Uh, return to previous app. So this is if uh, you use Google Now to uh, 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 execute a command or command. Uh, after that's done, you want it to go back to the app you were in when you went to Google Now. My answer, of course, is yes. As you can see, I checked it. And uh, first you have built-in commands. So these are commands that come built into uh, Commander. There's not a ton of these. Uh, there will be more added as time goes on. But right now you have flashlight on and off, Wi-Fi on and off, and it tells you what you have to say to execute it. Um, GPS on and off, which doesn't work for all devices, including mine. Uh, Bluetooth on and off, and then you also have a music pause, uh, resume, next song, and Google Music playlist. Uh, chatbot, if you want to chat. Uh, set their data on and off, read unread Gmail, raise volume or lower volume. So basically, uh, you use these commands with Google Now. I'm going to show you that in a uh, minute. Before I do that, I want to show you that you can also execute Tasker commands. Obviously, this is only going to work if, if you have Tasker installed on your phone. If you don't have Tasker, you should. And you can watch my review of Tasker as well as I have an entire series, almost 50 videos of Tasker tutorials teaching you how to use Tasker on your phone the best app ever uh, uh, developed for Android. So if you have Tasker, any task you set up, when you uh, click that will be in this list. And if you want a task to be able to be executed by voice through Google Now, you simply turn it on and then you click the edit button to create the phrase you want to say. Of course, you'll want that phrase to be a phrase that is different than any of the uh, phrases that Google Now normally recognizes. Otherwise, you'll have two things going on at once, and that would be confusing. So a good example uh, is, uh, let's see, I uh, have had this task on my phone for a long time, night sound. I have a NFC tag. I can tap uh, by my nightstand to set this, and uh, it just changes all my settings for when I go to bed at night. Um, I also have a button and here in my notification panel, the little Z's you see for sleeping. If I tap that, it triggers this task to make everything ready for night. But now I set this up with uh, Commander so that I can say goodnight Google and it'll trigger this as well. And I'll show you that in a minute. So uh, the only other thing, if you hit menu um, and you hit setup wizard, then it shows you, go, takes you through the process, swipe left, and accessibility service. Now this is what uh, you have to have accessibility service done if you don't want to say note to self. Uh, if you don't want to give this accessibility, then what you do is in Google Now, 
you start by saying note to self and then you give the command you want to execute. Note to self allows you to choose an app you want to execute whatever you say afterwards. Uh, and so you can do that. But if you give it accessibility service, then uh, you don't have to uh, say note to self. You can just give the command. And I'll show you that in just a second. So let's, uh, let's go to settings on my phone just so I can show you that really quick before I uh, demonstrate how awesome this app is and what it can do. Um, so here's accessibility. So if you tap accessibility, uh, you'll see services and you'll see commander for Google Now. I've turned it on and that's what you have to do. You have to turn it on and basically it allows Commander to listen to uh, everything that you're doing. So when you give a command to Google Now, Commander can listen to that command. If that's not on, then you have to do the note to self and then Google Now it sends the command over into Commander. So how does this work? Well. Okay, uh, uh, with Google Now, you can start it up without touching anything if you have a KitKat just by saying the phrase. So I'm going to say the phrase and then uh, I'm going to show you how it works. Okay, Google. Turn on flashlight. And you see, our flashlight is now on. Okay, Google. Turn off flashlight. My hand might have been blocking me there. Turn off flashlight. And you see it turned it off. So that was, uh, I'm giving the command in Google Now and it's, uh, a commander is intercepting that command and executing it. Uh, here's another uh, built-in one. You can see right there that my Wi-Fi is connected. So, okay, Google, turn off Wi-Fi. And you can see my Wi-Fi has disappeared. It's not there anymore. Okay, Google, turn on Wi-Fi. And now you can see my Wi-Fi came on and I've, I connected. So those are built-in commands. But you can also uh, execute your tasker task. So I created a tasker task that would read uh, the last uh, text that I've received. So now using uh, uh, Google Now and Commander, I can do that by voice. So I want you to see that this works no matter where you are on your phone and uh, also see uh, that because I had it checked, when it's done uh, executing, it returns back to uh, the screen you were on. Okay, Google, read my last text. Your last message from Eric Google at 14.47 reads, Hey, how's it going? So you see, it told me who my last text was from, the time, and uh, read it to me. Uh, now what it didn't do is it didn't return to the previous screen. I'm um, thinking that that part may only work for the built-in uh, stuff and not for the tasker stuff. But let's open another app and uh, we'll try it from there. Now this next one is the one I created uh, to say goodnight Google. Um, you can see my volume levels are all at the top. And uh, uh, I'll put it on auto brightness for now and we'll uh, see what happens when I execute this. Okay, Google. Good night, Google. Now you can see it uh, uh, opened up my alarm app. That's part of the task. It turned off auto brightness and lowered brightness all the way down. It also lowered my volume levels to what I want them to be when I'm sleeping at night. So that's all just by giving the voice command, uh, good night Google. And then opens up my alarm uh, clock app so I can set my alarm. So uh, uh, pretty, uh, uh, pretty cool. Let's uh, try uh, one more. You can see the little Bluetooth symbol right there. Okay, Google, 
turn off Bluetooth and you can see Bluetooth was turned off and it did return to the app that it was in before. Uh, so it looks like for right now the uh, uh, it returns to the app that it was in before when you do a built-in command. It doesn't look like it's working when you do a tasker command. So hopefully the uh, developer will get that working with uh, the tasker commands as well in the near future. But either way, at any rate, it's a uh, uh, quite uh, cool app, very easy to set up and uh, easy to use uh, in terms of uh, getting your phone really voice automated, to be able to do all different kinds of things uh, with your voice. Again, if you don't have Tasker, Tasker allows you to control a million different things and do a million different really cool complex things on your phone. And so by using the commander interface, uh, it allows you to do any of those things, trigger any of those things by voice through Google Now. That was Commander, as you can see. Uh, very cool app, fairly simple. Uh, once you have it set up, uh, all you have to do is, uh, especially if you have Tasker, just choose the task you want to execute, choose the commands you want to use, and uh, there you go. It's ready for you. Um, and really makes Google Now uh, uh, just that much better in terms of all the things you can do. Uh, possibilities are, are really endless once you integrate it with Tasker. So very, very cool app. Um, you can pick it up on the Play Store. I'll have the link below. So uh, check it out over there. And that's pretty much it for this review. If you like this review, please click that like button. If you know anyone who might be interested in a check-in commander out or seeing how it works, then please share this video on Facebook, Twitter, Google+. Reddit, all those ways are down there. Just click the appropriate button. Check out my channel for uh, over 200 videos of Android app reviews, all utility uh, productivity based apps to make your phone better. And also check out my Tasker tutorial series if you want to learn a lot more about how to use Tasker and uh, put it to good use for you on your phone. Also, I have product reviews with a lot of really cool electronics and uh, Android accessories that you might want to check out as well. So check those out and subscribe if you want to keep up with future videos. Anyway, that is it. Until next time, this is Eric reminding you that your Android phone is only going to be as good as you make it.